good morning guys what's up welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new today's friday i'm about to go into my chemistry class and i am so exhausted i worked 12 hours yesterday then i got home and had to stay up super late because i had two assignments due last night and then i had to wake up at 5 o'clock a.m because i had two assignments due at 8 a.m and i would have done them last night but i was obviously exhausted so i'm just really tired and i know today's gonna be rough on me because i have so much going on but we're gonna power through i haven't even had coffee yet i'm gonna go to class without coffee and i have a little bit of a break before i go to my ta's office hours so i figured i'll just get coffee in between that but i'm determined to have a good day even though it's going to be busy it's a little bit later i'm back home but i'm heading back to school now I actually did not film any of this, but I came home and I took a nap, okay? I was tired and I had a really long day yesterday at work. I did not get much sleep and I was like, if I'm gonna get anything done today, I need a power nap. So that's what I did and wow, this is not focusing. But anyway, now I am going back to school and now the productivity starts. So I just parked at school and I stopped at Sweetberry on my way and picked up an acai bowl and this has strawberries, banana, coconut, Nutella, granola, and then like the acai smoothie mixture. Super excited to eat this. I was gonna take it up to the library but I feel like it's already so melted now so I think I'm just gonna chill in my car, eat this, and then go in. I printed off my study guide for chemistry so I'm pretty much gonna be going through that because my tutoring appointments at 2 30 and that way i can figure out whatever i don't know so i can go over it with him i love that there's like nutella smeared around the thing that i have to lift i'm really glad i spotted that before i went to go open it okay but how amazing does this look from my tutoring appointment that actually went really well. The person who tutored me wasn't a student, it was actually a former chemistry instructor and he just does tutoring now, so he obviously really knew what he was doing and I learned a lot, so now I just have a bunch of things that I need to practice. Chad and I were actually gonna go out tonight and have like a little date night and go out to dinner and stuff because it's Friday night, but I made the executive decision to stay in because I really need to study. I work all day on Sunday and on Tuesday. So I pretty much only have today and tomorrow to get ready for my first exam and I just wanna make sure I'm ready. So I'm gonna be spending my Friday night studying. the chai latte and I also grabbed some of these Siete chips that are from Whole Foods. I freaking love these. They're so good and they're like a really plain chip but they're like thin and crispy. I love the flavor and if you look at the ingredients they're like so clean and simple so you don't have to feel guilty about eating them at all and uh, I don't even know where I'm going to begin. I honestly have so much to cover. I think I'm just going to start with my study guide and just go through all of the problems and circle the ones that I don't know how to do, um, which is gonna be a lot because it's a struggle. So here's my study guide for our first exam. And then this is like the paper that goes over the key concepts. I think I told you guys it's on chapter one and two. So this is basically everything that I need to know. And there's a bunch of practice questions online. So what I'm gonna be doing tonight is going over the study guide. There's 60 questions on here, so lots of practice. I'm just gonna start with number one and I'm gonna be working on them on this. So I just grabbed a few pieces of loose leaf paper and stapled it together. That's kind of how I'm gonna do this. I have a bunch of notes on my iPad, so if I need to access those, then I will. But for the most part, I'm gonna be trying really hard to do this without looking at notes. And then I'll highlight or circle the ones that I'm unable to do because obviously those are the ones that I need more practice on. And then I also have to memorize the prefixes that are circled here in red per my instructor. So I'm gonna make some flashcards because I need to learn those. Right now I don't have any of that memorized.
made us shrimp scampi for dinner and it looks so good. So I'm having a little study break and eating dinner. Just finished eating dinner and I'm drinking my water out of my hydro flask. I have showed you guys this before, but it honestly is the best water bottle ever. And I've been really doing a good job of filling it up, trying to remember to bring it with me so that I don't forget to drink water. I'll link it for you guys because it's an awesome water bottle and it really does keep your drink cold all day. I'm sitting here debating if I want to do a face mask while I'm studying or wait until I'm completely done. But I feel like by the time I'm done with this, I'm going to be too tired to do a face mask and I really want to do one because I got Got a new face mask in the mail yesterday it's the clinique city block charcoal mask i think it's called and i used a sample of it like months ago and i really really liked it but for whatever reason i never bought the full size until the other day i bought it so i'm really excited to use it update i put the face mask on and oh my gosh even though i look crazy right now i seriously forgot how much i love this face mask it is just one of the best ones i actually think i like this clinique one better than the origins clay mask and that one is really good as well but here's what the box looks like if you guys want it and the packaging looks like this but it's i think it's like 30 dollars, but it's so worth it because this lasts you forever like it's such a small amount and it just spreads out so evenly and i especially love that this is only a five minute mask whereas a lot of face masks or charcoal masks you have to leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes to wait for it to harden um and this one hardens after like you know five minutes so it's really nice highly recommended i will leave it in the description and while i'm letting this sit for five minutes i'm going to watch a video. tonight is writing down a to-do list for tomorrow because even though it's Saturday it's basically going to be like another college day in my life tomorrow because I'm not going to be having classes but I'm going to be doing schoolwork all day long so let me know if you guys want me to vlog tomorrow because it's honestly gonna, it's just going to be a bunch of schoolwork but I'm going to try to like switch up my environment so I'll probably go to FGCU for a little bit I was thinking about going and studying at Panera Bread tomorrow and just getting breakfast in there and working on my chemistry study guide but we'll see i haven't really decided yet i also need to go to ulta tomorrow and then i feel like i have some other errands to run but it's going to be a super productive day and i'm also thinking about doing a q a soon because i have so many new subscribers and i feel like it's a good video to do whenever you have new subscribers so they can get to know you a little bit better so if i do a q a i'll probably just ask you guys to ask me questions on my instagram sorry this vlog is probably a little shorter than a typical vlog for me i have just been like stressed to the max with chemistry you guys like i feel like me being me knowing how to study i'm pretty decent at it this class is like studying on a whole nother level it's just so different for me so i'm struggling a little bit not gonna lie uh just to be real with you guys but i will get through it i know how to work hard and i'm gonna go to tutoring and i'm gonna utilize my resources we got this if you're not already subscribed be sure to click that subscribe button and i'll see you in my next video